Okay, well, here we are at the uh, Travelers Championship as the first round is well underway. Uh, leaders are already at about three under par, so there's a lot going on. But if you're familiar with the Travelers Championship, you know it's not just about golf. Even after the day is done, there's a lot going on, including the concert series being presented by Liberty Bank. I'm so happy to have the CEO of uh, Liberty Bank, Mr. Chandler Howard, back with us again. For uh, I'm, I'm trying to think whether this is maybe the third or the fourth year we've had. Yeah, I think this Somewhere is the third right year. Around. Yeah, yeah. Uh, good to see you again, sir. Good to see you. A pleasure well. to have you here. And uh, just the fact that you're back again year after year to talk to me means Liberty Bank is, must really be enjoying this partnership with the Travelers Championship. Yeah, it means a lot to us. You know, we're the uh, oldest bank in the state of Connecticut, been around since 1825, and this is the oldest sporting event in the state of uh, Connecticut. So um, it's, a good, it's a good combination. Yeah. And uh, the uh, concert series also has been going on for a long time. How did you guys decide to get involved in that particular way? The uh, concert series we've been involved with since uh, this is our third year. Uh, and, um, you know, one of the great things about this tournament is that it's not just about golf. It's also about uh, activities that all the people who come out, all the fans can participate in. So when the concert series became available, we thought it was a great opportunity uh, to, uh, you know, provide some entertainment for uh, people who maybe aren't necessarily golfers. Yes, it's all about trying to get the whole family in. I, we got Survivor on Friday, and that's just another one of those blast from the past bands. Uh, Tyler Farr, country music rising star, coming in on Saturday, and again, those concerts more or less start pretty much after the last shot is struck yeah, right, uh, on, right on Friday and Saturday, and it's a uh, it's a, a great job uh, that they do to put that on. <laughs> that's, yeah. I mean, that's an undertaking, even in and of itself, there at the fan zone. Uh, talk to me about Liberty Bank, and uh, I, I know why it's important to partner with Travelers, but what has Travelers done to try to reach out to a lot of these iconic Connecticut businesses like Liberty Bank to try to make this a good symbiotic relationship? Yeah, the, the, the tournament is really about giving back and giving back to charities. You know, the tournament has given back millions and millions of dollars uh, over the years. Uh, and to have corporations and other businesses get involved, that's really what it's about, uh, an opportunity to give back. Uh, at the bank, we have a foundation. Uh, we've been uh, giving back to the community for many, many years. Yeah. Uh, we're giving about $800,000 a year right now. Uh, we've given uh, 11 million, over $11 million back to the community since we've uh, started our foundation. Uh, and, you know, we feel like we're a part of the community. We're a community bank. Mm -hmm. We're Connecticut's oldest bank. Uh, and it's just a way for us to be uh, engaged in the community and be a uh, part of the community and do something good uh, yeah. for uh, organizations that, you know, provide really, really vital, important services to the community. And I imagine at Liberty Bank that philanthropy has grown as the company has grown under your leadership, which it has considerably over the years. Yeah, yeah, we've, uh, we're uh, almost five billion in size now, which for a bank isn't all that large, um, but uh, our commitment to uh, philanthropy uh, has also grown, as I said, our, uh, mostly through our foundation, uh, but also our employees. Our employees uh, volunteer every year roughly 13 or 14,000 hours of their own time uh, that they give back to the uh, community, uh, and they get involved in all kinds of things. Um, you know, they go out and they work in soup kitchens, they'll uh, go to schools and, and uh, tutor. Uh, all, all sorts of activities, uh, and it's just so important that uh, as a community bank, we also uh, invest back in the community. And again, Liberty Bank, the sponsor of the concert series. We've got Survivor on Friday, Tyler Farr on Saturday. Mr. Howard, good to see you again. Good to see you as well. Glad to have you here. Great things you guys are doing there at Liberty Thank Bank. Thank you. All right, now we have to run, but we're going to be back in a couple of minutes with a lot more on whom this tournament is benefiting. Some great faces, familiar faces we've seen year after year. The Hospital for Special Care coming up. Uh, but that's it for right now. We'll be back in a couple of minutes here at TPC River Highlands with more on the Travelers Championship.